quarter past five in the morning. I've got uh, 125 miles drive south, where this morning we're heading down to Lawford Lakes, where we're hopefully gonna catch a few fish for our latest group coaching day. It's a very different day now from what it was at quarter past five this morning. It's a beautiful sunny day. Um, this is Special Lake at Larford, and this has really been a day all about um, catching silverfish. It's about times when it's when it's hard. There's been a very sharp frost here overnight, and that is when the fishing can be really difficult. Today we've kind of been fishing uh, really negative, but all the lads are catching. There are ten lads here, all in a row. Dean Barlow's right down there somewhere. We're fishing on two lines, and we're fishing one line really negative and one line really positive. currently one hour into the session and all the lads are catching hand sized skimmers on their longer line it's going to be interesting to see how that short line kicks in a little bit later on so I'm going to have a walk down now and find out how the lads are getting on second. well done Dave is that your second? We're about minus four degrees here last night. Two, 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 cast two. Hold on, mate. Working. Well, we've got a little bit of a ripple coming onto it now. We've been fishing an hour, off, an hour and a half now. The lads are just about to have a look on their short lines. They've been catching loads of small skimmers. And Mr. Barlow's here. What are you seeing so far, Dean? It's fishing well, isn't it? Yeah, there's plenty of bites. Uh, to be fair, when we got here this morning, there was uh, still frost on the side of the bank. And uh, we thought we might be in for a bit of a difficult day, but there's plenty of skimmers feeding. All the guys are, uh, are doing it spot on to be fair. Uh, they're all messing around with the ground bait, making sure that uh, the keep bites coming. So yeah, they're all doing really well. And as you'll probably notice, there's, there's, there's a few landing nets going out all the time. So yeah, it's a, it's a good session. So like Jamie said, they're uh, just about to go on the short line. So we'll see if there's any uh, proper fish feeding at this moment in time. So I think it's about bream o'clock. So we're open, we get some decent pulls. Yeah, we're gonna have a walk down the line now and uh, get the lads to change, and it'll be interesting to see if any fish have settled on that short line. Just into the final stages now. It's gone flat calm, but it's been amazing how this short line has really come strong, just as you'd expect. Just like setting your watch some days, you set that short line up for later on, and it's amazing how many times and better fish turn up. The lads have done a few changes today. There's been lots of small fish there, but they made a few changes, put a bigger bait on, tweaked one or two things, and start feeding slightly different. And it's amazing how it's kind of deterred those small fish. We've just been a lot more selective about them better fish. 
and it's worked a treat just slowing it down slight lining but yeah as you can see it's turned into a beautiful afternoon now that sun is still beating down on us the wind's dropped but the fish will look stunning when it's like this I'm back here in about three or four weeks time for the silverfish festival which I haven't fished for the last two or three years so I'm really looking forward to getting back down here so it's been nice to see the fishery and, uh, and how it's fishing but as you can see it's uh, they've had quite a bit of rain the water levels been up so one or two other platforms need checking and stuff but as you can see it's not just put the fish off at all it's fishing really really well it's been a really great day so it's just getting up to quarter past three now so all we're going to do now is just get the lads together have a bit of a debrief have a quick chat about how the session's gone on and um, let's have a look at some of the catchers because some of the lads have had their nets in today so it'll be interesting to see what kind of nets of fish they've got We've got the setting sun behind us. How nice does that look? The fishery's been fantastic today. For what we've wanted to do today, the conditions have been ideal in the sense that we wanted it to be hard. We wanted it to be winter. It's been flat calm, bright sunshine, freezing cold. There were, you know, the, well, all the puddles here were iced up. It's been freezing and all the lads, as you've just seen, have caught loads and loads of fish. They've had to make some changes, haven't they? Unbelievable, the, the, the venue and the weather hasn't let us down for what, what we tried to achieve today and uh, the guys have responded absolutely brilliantly and they've all been rewarded with some decent nets of fish and quality fish as well so like I say we had to make some changes because surprise surprise Larford it's got a lot of tiny little skimmers in. So, yeah just like I mean a lot of people have said that about Boston that there's been lots of this sort of four to the pound. Yeah four ounce fish something like that and which is never normally seen this time of the year which is nice to get bites but the, uh, the thing with today was try and catch better quality fish and everyone's been able to do that. So yeah, it's been a really good session. Yeah, the first step was obviously getting bites. Once all the lads were getting bites, they then had to change from them because they knew they wouldn't win a match with those. They've had to find a way of catching them and, and yeah. that's what's happened. It's been great for that. Just a bit of changing in uh, the feed and everything like that has made all the difference. You, you could have sat there catching little fish thinking there isn't a decent fish in your peg, but we know that they're there. So. Like we've always said on our uh, coaching sessions, the, it's the little details that make all the difference. Yeah, it's been brilliant. The lads have done great. And, uh, and it's freezing. It, <laughs> it is freezing. Um, the we, setting sun has got, I think someone needs to turn the thermostat up. It's freezing. It's definitely winter. <laughs> and that's what this has all been about. We have got another session like this in a few weeks' time on this venue when it's probably going to be even colder. Yeah. But that's what this is about. It's cold water skimmer fishing or yeah. silver fish fishing. Um, so I hope we've enjoyed this bit of an insight into these sessions. We've already got several of these planned for this year. So if you are interested in them, please just email me at the address below or send Dean a message. I know a lot of your friends with him on Facebook. Um, and a lot of these sessions are going to be tied into some of the live match and session videos that we're going to be doing as well. So if you don't want to miss out on any of them, just hit subscribe. And if you want to hear more about these sorts of sessions and you want more coaching, tuition style videos from both myself and Dean, because Dean's very much on board as well with my other channel, Patron TV. Please just have a look at the link just there and in the bottom left-hand corner if you want to check that out. So thanks for joining us today. Yeah, I enjoyed it, mate. Thanks very much indeed. It's been great. Yeah. And like I say, if anyone's interested, just please get in touch. And if you don't want to miss it out on any other videos, just give it a subscribe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you all on the bank in the next video. See you later. <laughs>